Hey Matthew, how you doing, man? Good. How good you to doing? see you. Good. I'm here with the great Matthew Fox, yeah. and uh, it's wonderful to talk to you. First of all, I want to geek out on you a little bit. You really wowed me in Alex Cross. I thought you were amazing in that role. Oh, thank so, you. Yeah, it was thank great you to see much. you play a bad guy. Thank really you. sink your teeth into that. Yeah. Thank you very much. Now, uh, let's talk about Bone Tomahawk. It's great to have Hollywood kind of seeing a little bit of a renaissance for the Western. And yeah. uh, I'm so happy to see more Westerns being made. I'm sure that when you were approached and you know with material like this, it's like, oh yeah, let's go, let's do it. Right? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I mean, I, I love the script from the, from the very first read. Um, I didn't know much about Craig, uh, Mr. Zoller at the time, but um, I then went and read all of the, his novels, and I'm, he's now like one of my favorite writers. I just think he's absolutely extraordinary and really has a unique vision. And um, yeah, I was incredibly excited. And of course, you add Kurt Russell in a Western to that whole picture, and then you get Richard Jenkins in it yeah. and Patrick. And I mean, you know, it all just came together, and I was really excited to be a part of it. What was it like working with Craig behind the camera? This is his directorial debut. What was he able to bring to that part of it? Well, I mean, you know, he's, he's his directorial debut, but the material is his. He was incredible to work with. He was so accommodating. Um, we had long, you know, we, he was so willing to take time out of the moment and like sort of talk you through things that you were having difficulty with or things that we were shooting for that he didn't feel like we were quite getting. He was incredible. He was amazing. I, I can't say enough good things about him as, as a first time director. It was amazing. Um, yeah, I mean, I would work with him again in a heartbeat. I love him. Did you guys get to bring kind of your own unique little touches to the characters, or was it already all there on the page? Oh, oh no, no. I think a lot. Every, I mean, it was very much of it was on the page. The, the writing was amazing, and the language is just incredible. I mean, some of the some of the things that we all get to say in this movie is just like really interesting language. Yeah. Um, and and it feels very authentic to me. You know, authentic from his world. It's just beautiful. Um, but yeah, we all got, and he was he was very open to us bringing in ideas about like what we thought, what we felt these guys were like. And literally after the first couple of days, he was like, "You guys, you know these characters better than I do now, and you've taken them and run with them." And so he was always deferring to us in that respect. I was asking Craig this: uh, What are some of your favorite westerns? Uh, like maybe growing up, watching as a kid, what are some of the things that stick out in your memory? Um, well, you know, I mean, the Searchers and and. Um, um, I, I absolutely love The Unforgiven, um, and then going back into the Leone stuff, like Fistful of Dollars and Hang 'Em High. Um, I, I, I started. I introduced my little boy, who's I call him my little boy, but he's turned he's turned 14 here in a, in a couple of days. But uh, introduced to him uh, those movies to him a couple of years ago, and he's just like the biggest fan. And we're always doing like the the, the soundtracks from him and stuff like that. So. I'm just a huge fan of the genre. Always have been. I read a lot of Western when I was Western books when I was kid. You know, I was a huge fan of Louis L'Amour for a couple of years. I just ate up Louis L'Amour's and read them over and over again. The Virginian is one of my all-time favorite books. Um, so it's a genre that you know I, I really have always loved and always will. Have you seen My Name Is Nobody? No. Show him that one. That's a great. One. I will. And the last question I'll ask you before I let you go, because I think everybody wants to know this. Are the numbers still bad? <laughs> I don't know, man. You don't know? I don't know. <laughs> Matthew Fox, everybody. Thanks, man. It's yeah, a pleasure to meet you. you. Yeah, take care.